Argument Concerning the Judgment By the judgments which have preceded, preparation has been made for the universal judgment. Concerning the new heavens, which they made for themselves. Concerning the going forth of some before the last judgment, who were in faith separate, and that they were first visited and separated. Who they were that made for themselves heavens, it was seen that they acted there as in Sodom. There were seen rocks carried away like a cloud. Those who were in faith alone betook themselves upon the rocks. How they dwelt there, earthquakes proceeded. The wicked spirits in the plain were cast out, and the good reserved by the Lord were taken up in their place, and this to open the sepulchres. The destructions which preceded the last judgment, how the divine sphere enters into them, and thence opens up their interiors, the quality of those upon whom the last judgment was effected, the arrangement of the reformed before the judgment, also where and how they were arranged, how they were first led forth, the casting down of those in faith alone, and then exploration, likewise others, how they were then seen, their dispersion, the angels wondered at such faith, they have no conscience. The purifying of the middle lasts a long time. Some were seen at a table, clothed as if with wedding garments, but within they were robbers. They were cast down. They appeared as if sincere, yet they are wolves within. Their lot. The exploration of the reformed as to their quality and their distinction into classes. Their ideas of the Lord of those who were in piety and external worship, their lot, hypocrites, their lot, priests who read the word only that they may preach it, their lot. They are separated according to the internals of life which are affections, dragons, how they are explored, who those are who are in confirmation and in pride, what they are, what is draconic, Anyone can know what charity is, that it is not to steal, etc. The good who were left were allotted their habitations. Those who have understood and known many things, and with whom there was no will of good, their lot. Those who have not acknowledged the Lord, and have no good of charity, their rebellion and conjunction with the Papists and Mohammedans, their lot. Something said of the combat of the dragon with Michael, the Lord seen in a cloud, a representation of a tale, those who are in faith alone and in the love of commanding look downward, their quality, how they are distinguished according to their idea of God, five classes, they persecuted me by inspirations and at the same time respirations and pulse, experience thence, the thought of those who are in faith alone described, their quality was such although they had not thought wickedly, such were let out of the hells, they believing that they would then act well, but in vain they were in anguish. The arrangement into societies, the purification of societies, the arrangement takes place according to the affections of the life, not according to the affections of the understanding, the nature of their ways afterwards, the most perfect arrangement is that of the reformed. The reason is that they have the word and they go to the Lord how they are taken up into heaven, the words of the Lord, they who have faith as a seed of mustard, the goats and their combats, in like manner, the dragon, why it treats of them in the apocalypse, draconic spirits, the power of truth in the spiritual world, experience, those who have little of life, how life is inspired into them, the religion of those who are in faith alone, it is only knowledge. They who combat against evils receive the law as if inscribed on themselves. Conducted into a mansion of heaven. What is the opinion in the third heaven concerning those in faith alone? It is only knowledge. According as they lived in the world, so is their heaven. The quality of those who are in faith alone and its quality as it interiorly appears how the epistle of James appears to them. They are received who believe in charity, provided they have lived the life of charity. 
One was turned about, but he turned back afterwards. The arrangement of those who are in the faith of charity. In their factitious heavens there was a wintry light. The hells where they continually wrangle about their faith, their quality. By experience those who believed that they had faith, it was given them to know that they had no faith. Their interiors were closed. They had a religion of the memory. They were sensual. Faith alone of the church is not given from experience. Those who are in no affection of truth and yet reason much about truths, experience. Those who are in faith alone have no conscience. Those who believe in charity and do not live the life of charity are not much unlike those in faith alone. How faith separate leads to evil of life. I spoke with Melanchthon about faith alone, how false it is. Those who are in faith alone cannot be saved, what their quality is. Because all the societies of heaven are arranged according to the differences of love. An Englishman who wished to conjoin charity with faith, but it was not recognized. I read before the English their prayer before the Eucharist and my discourse with them. English presbyters who made an idol of their faith. Discourse with the English concerning faith alone the nature of their arguments for faith alone. Those were explored who confessed faith in the last hour of death and their quality. After the judgment, many of those from faith alone were collected and rejected. Afterwards, many wished to receive charity, but in vain, the reason. The endeavor after justification, free will with them. It is not allowed them to preach. The hearers go out. The deserts where those are who are in faith alone. They were explored whether they know anything true, and it was found that they do not. Conversation with angels concerning the progression of truth to good. How the English write their discourses. That faith saves no one, a few things. It is like a dark chamber. Their miserable state who have regarded evils as allowable and their internal. All the states of love return after death, thus the states of faith, if it enters the love. At this day they crucify the Lord, the ideas at this day concerning God, heaven, love, and faith, the first state of man after death. Love produces the knowledge of every good in the thought. They who are in the love of self cannot be admitted into heaven. They who are in the love of self can equally speak of the divine, but yet after death, they are against the divine. They are enemies of the Lord, experience. Two opposite dominions of love, their interiors and quality. Examples from those in the equestrian order. Love corresponds to flame, faith to light. The quality of those who worship the Lord from spiritual love. Affection makes the man from changes induced and correspondences. The delight of the love of commanding exceeds every other delight. The delight of the love of commanding into what it is turned after death. Everyone after death comes into his own love. F.R. Jill, his mode of praying. The quality after death of him who is in the delight of commanding. Dreadful example of hatred against the Lord with those who think nothing from religion in their life.